Military camp. No locals allowed without the express consent of the garrison commander. I look like a local to you? You look like trouble. Dead wrong. I make trouble go away. I'm a witcher. A witcher? Yep. Can you make trouble go away? In the tower. Turn right, past the gate. Guessing your captain's got work for me. This is the army, Nordling. There is no guessing. Okay. To the tower. Go. Friendly people. Is there something over there? I'm gonna try that in a second. Oh, is it true? Northern women bathe behind. Yay, so that's the opposite of the grindstone. So you can enhance your armor temporarily at workbenches. Okay. Okay. Let's speak to the garrison commander. How much grain will your village give? Whatever you say, Your Excellency. Look at my hands. Look. See the calluses? These are not the hands of an Excellency, but of a farmer. So we speak peasant to peasant. How much can you give? Forty bushels. There'd be more, sir, but our lads, the Temerians, that is, took from us earlier and... You will give thirty, and that will do. Let us settle on it, and I wish to see the transport soon. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you kindly. He's awfully friendly. I summoned only the Elderman and the Smith, Willis. But it is said he is a dwarf. You are too tall to be him. And too handsome. Very perceptive of you. Geralt of Rivia, Witcher. Vatgarn. This explains why I did not hear your footsteps. What do you seek here? Yennefer of Vengerberg. Where was she headed? That is a military secret. What? Haven't thrown me out yet. Haven't called the guards. So go ahead. What's your price? There is a griffin in the area. Slay it. And then I shall see what I can do. We've met that one before. Why do you care about this griffin? Because I care about people. The beast has killed ten already. Including a few of my men. To hunt it, I would need to mobilize the entire garrison, comb the woods, organize a batu. Simply impossible. Too big a hassle? No. Too high a risk. And also kill the horse. I cannot disperse my forces. Demeria's army we have crushed, but its common folk remain, ready to answer a call to arms. So, as to this griffin, I can sit on my hands? Or. Hire a professional. Nice compliment. Let's it's do deal. this. Some questions before I start. Know where the griffin has its lair? It kept to the vulpine woods at first. I sent a patrol there. Five young men. A hunter found them two days on. They only recognized them because they wore our plate. Since then, the griffin has grown bold. Attacks in villages, fields, on the main road. Meaning it's abandoned its lair. Gonna have to set a trap. I judge from your tone this will not be easy. What do you require? Apparently something's very specific. That more information could always Need help. Need more information about this griffin. Its sex. Why it's abandoned its lair. Shall I bring you witnesses? They won't say anything I don't already know. I need to go where your men died. Look around. What's the name of the hunter who found them? Mislov. He has a hut south of the village, very near the wood. Helpful fellow. A little strange, though. Mislov. And then the herb? I'll need bait. A specific herb. Buckthorn. 
Scent should lure the griffin from ten miles off. Buck... Buck Thorn? I do not know this. But I am not yet fluent in the common tongue. Mm -hmm. Probably mastered the basics, though. Hands up. Kill them. Ooh. No. First came idioms. Don't play with fire, for example. <laughs> Go to Tomira, an herbalist. She lives near the crossroads. She will aid you. Okay. Thank you. Tamira and Miss Peter, Love. I think. Thanks. Es soon the actin. So yeah, the Nilf Guardian language again. So the hunter and the herb oh that's the herbalist. Okay. Password. Dunno any. So out for a little walk, eh? Counting the Emperor's swords to lull you to sleep? Well, in the army, we've a place for nosy ramblers. The scaffold. And thick skulled quartermasters. They got a place. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you're clearly skilled at banter. And haggling? You got a knack for that as well? You should have. Um, let's see. Show me where you're peddling. Let's sell some stuff because he seems to have a lot of coin. Jeez. Okay. I think I can dismantle the silver into silver ingots. Switch so out my steel sword for the one I have. There we have it. Uh, the armor piercing is gone, however. Well, I'll see how it goes. So that's about it. I'm gonna also check the bestiary entry for the griffin. I half eagle, half tomcat, just like on the Lord's crest. Septison was carrying me dead cows, Ted of a scepter. Okay. Griffin attack witness name unknown. Griffins were once only found high in the mountains, where they would hunt mar marmots and wild goats. When humans encroached on their lands, however, griffins soon discovered a new source of much more plentiful and easier cult prey. Cows, sheep and shepherds. Though still wary of main roads and towns where folk with the means to hire a witcher or like to dwell, these half-eagle, half-wildcat creatures have gone from rarities to often countered pests known throughout the northern realms. Especially hated are the subspecies known as royal griffins and arch griffins, so vulnerable against a grape shield bomb, hybrid oil and the art sign. The necrophages are just... Ghouls and graveyards are hard to describe, in part they resemble humans, yet on the whole they are the utter negation of all that is human. Though they have arms and legs like men, they walk on all fours like dogs or badgers. Though they have eerily familiar faces, one searches them in vain for any sign of sentiment, reason or even a spark of consciousness. They are driven by one thing and one thing only, an insatiable craving for human flesh. So that's all we have for now. I will be returning here once every while. So I'm gonna see what I need to make those bombs. Salpeter and calcium equum. Okay then. Let's keep that in mind. So let's check out... Okay, what the fuck? That was weird. So yeah, I'm gonna save and I'm gonna try... I'm gonna try and jump over this. Okay. Ooh, chest. Another sword. Okay, great. More stuff. Obsidian Gambazon and more orange. Anything else? 
that's too far. Whew. Okay, go back. So I probably shouldn't be looting any of these. Don't be unreasonable. Okay. Not doing anything. I'm gonna check out that gambazon. On a much higher level. Uh, Pompeii. So pretty much the same resistances except for the elemental resistance, but it's better, so... It looks ridiculous, though. Oh, and the sword... Yeah, it's the same. Okay. Once discovered, signposts allow you to travel directly from one location to another. Thank you. Um. Kings do the fighting, but peasants do the dying. Okay, let's see. We'll do the missing in action quest first. So, let's see... I might just fast travel there. So, see you in a second. So, we're back at the ransacked village we encountered at the beginning. Burying the bodies of hanged deserters and rebels is hereby strictly forbidden. Anyone caught trying to cut down hanging corpses will be summarily executed. Great. But we are here to find June Wildenvert. To escort him to find his brother, his dad. Holy shit! here for your leather straps. That, I felt a bit bad doing that. So, let's save again. Hello, Jim. Do that often? Talk to your dog? It's my brother's, Bastion's. But, I guess he's mine now. See, Bastion fought the Black Ones in a battle just outside the village. I haven't had word of him since. I told him, do like I did, lose a finger or two so they won't recruit you. Too damn afeard he was. Bloody hell. Okay, I'm gonna help you. I'd walk the battlefield if I were you. I did. Sea of corpses. And corpses feeding. Someone told me they're afraid of fire, so I took a torch, tried to chase them off. Horse shite, I tell you. Would have ended up eaten alive if it weren't for Hussar here. Listen, guessing you carry those swords for more than show. Come with me, keep the ghouls off. Help me find Bastion and I'll pay you well. I will. Fine, I'll help you. Just... Been a few days since the battle. Chances we find your brother alive are slim. Very slim. I would have thought, but I want to find his body at least. So Bastion don't rot there in the sun with the black ones. Meet me on the hill overlooking the battlefield. We'll move on together from there. So many corpses, and the war's just started. Now things seems to be calm. Oh. 
Okay. You're here, good. Bastion... His body must be here somewhere. Among countless others. Want to examine them one by one? Could take a while. You needn't fret. The recruits from White Orchard painted a small flower on their shields so as to be able to spot each other in battle. There was just a few of them. We look for the flowers, we'll find Bastion quick. No offense, but many of soldiers dropped his shield, especially if he was on the losing side. If we find the shield alone, Hassan will catch the scent and lead us to Bastion. Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. True. So, let's find this bastion. So there's at least three ghouls over there. Use the meat. Okay, that's fun. Wow, that dog does a lot of damage. Okay. I said I love the dog. Doesn't look anything like him. Okay. Come on, Hassar. Can you smell Bastion, boy? Uh, still nothing. Oh. There are useful things on these corpses sometimes. This. That this one? No. Neighbor's son. Okay. Come on, Hassar. Can you smell Bastion, boy? Uh, There's another one. That him? No. Neighbor's son. Also, okay. The neighbor had a lot of sons. Come on, Hassar. Can you smell Bastion, boy? And the one here. Uh, skin's burned off. Might be hard to tell, I know, but could this be him? Oh, yeah. Bastion was big, broad shouldered. This one seems smaller, but maybe it's the fire did that. Could be. He found him! The SARS caught his scent! Come on! Oh, this is not a good idea. Holy shit. A shack. There is more. My lieutenant demanded we defecate on command. Oh. Ballista bolts landing all around, and all he could say was, 
A soldier with a full stomach huh. will not step onto the battlefield. Now, shit, that is an order. Can you believe it? The cretin. Stop! Oh, you're, oh, you're killing me. My, my ribs. Oh, it hurts to laugh. That needs wow. a tourniquet. But first, want to explain what's going on here? Bastion! Is he... Has this Nilfgaardian captured you? No. He saved my life. I, I got a cut to me side. And then got hit in the head. Couldn't see anything. Rosin here found me as... As he crawled across the battlefield. His legs twisted. And so we were. Blind man leading a cripple. Found this place. I'm taking you home. We need to see to these wounds. I won't leave Rosin here. I'll own he'll die. And he can't go back to his home. He's deserted. They'll hang him. And what if they find him with us? They'll hang us all, my Laetia included. No, the Blackened stays here. I think you're supposed to pronounce that Laetia. Because that's a Dutch name. Because we found her a while back. Well, let's try and save him. We can give him one of the uniforms of the other dead guys, I think. Bastion only made it with the Black One's help. Maybe you ought to show him Nordlings aren't as barbarous as Nilfgaardians make us out to be. Well, I could give him our pa's clothes, teach him to work the field. But that accent... Fine, I'll take him in. Thank you, Witcher. Your reward, and the gods protect you. That was a great story. Two soldiers from different armies helping each other out. And that's another great side quest done. So, uh, I'm gonna stand here next to Rusar. And we're gonna end, I'm gonna end the episode here, so thank you guys for watching. And I hope to see you in the next video. Goodbye! <laughs>